6.30. Good morning, Hawaii. I'm Lai'u Ikaholukula. And I'm Aleka McDonald. We're staying on top of breaking news this morning out of Makaha. Detectives are in the air. We're in the area on the scene for a murder investigation. That's where we find KLATV 4s Aaron Coogan with what we know so far and new details, Aaron. Like, good morning to you. Well, it's been just over six hours since those initial calls came here to Farrington Highway right off of Upena Street. Now, those investigative teams have already left the scene about two hours ago, but the latest developments coming out of the initial investigation revealing this was not believed to be a random act. What we know is those initial calls coming from a witness saying she saw uh, a male and a female uh, du duking it out in the middle of Farrington Highway when the first responders came they identified a 40 year old woman uh, in the middle of the street. She was found unconscious. Uh, they would give her life saving efforts, but she would die on site. And then a little bit down the road, they found a 19 year old boy. He was uh, said to be involved with that assault and they arrested him for murder in the second degree. Now, investigation was ongoing all of this morning here on Farrington Highway, the main portion of this road, finding any pieces of evidence they could, of course, those using uh, to make a more well-rounded picture of what happened. Again, they say this is not a random act. They are said to have known each other. Of course, when more details come into our newsroom, we will share them with you. For now, reporting live, Aaron Coogan, KITV4 Island News.